Thank you, Madam President. Last night, we heard from the governor about how Michigan is recovering. And certainly, there are metrics and spreadsheets that show that Michigan is moving in a positive direction. But numbers and spreadsheets cannot be more important than the people we serve. And they certainly do not paint a full picture. People and corporations are feeling the recovery at the top. But recovery does not matter much if the average hardworking Michigan family is not feeling it. And those at the middle and those at the bottom just aren't. And nowhere is this more evident than in our youngest generation. This generation is the slowest to buy a car, buy a house, or start a family. But that makes sense when you look at the numbers. The median annual household income in Michigan is stagnant at $49,576. The average student in Michigan graduates with $30,000 in debt. The average cost of child care is $9,882, and that's just for one child. Colleagues, we can't move Michigan forward if we leave this generation behind. We can't just invest in corporations. We have to invest in Michigan's people. That is why I'm introducing bills today that will give tax relief to help relieve student debt and to help parents with the cost of child care. As a father of four, I know raising a family will never be easy. It shouldn't be. Raising a family is the most important thing that any of us will ever do. Now, I know that these bills won't solve every problem, but they will make it a little bit easier. A little easier to raise a family. A little easier to send your kid to college. A little easier to stay here in Michigan. Just a little easier. Colleagues, I'm asking you to join me in signing on to these bills. They are available at my desk for co-sponsorship. They would make it just a little easier for Michigan's families.